We're frequently asked, what's the difference between caps and plugs? This is a cap, this is a plug. Caps are used to cap off a piece of tubing. A cap is a complete suede lock assembly. You have nuts, front ferrule, back ferrule, and a fitting body, but the fitting body is blank. This allows you to install the nuts and ferrules onto the tubing and actually pre-swage them onto the tubing. So you'd simply slide the tubing up tight against the shoulder of the fitting, pull up this nut one and a quarter turns, and it's completely done, and you can fully pressurize your system. Now later, when you're ready to use the fitting, you simply remove the blank fitting body, and when you're ready to install it, you remove the nuts and ferrules from the suede lock tube fitting, assemble the tubing with the pre-swage nuts and ferrules on it, and now you'll follow the reassembly instructions, which simply say you tighten the nut finger tight, tighten the nut with a wrench until you feel significant resistance, and then snug a little bit more, and the job's all done. It's ready to go. A plug now plugs off a port. So if you want to use a T, but you only want to use two ends of the T, you simply remove the nuts and ferrules or the piece of tubing, take the plug, and it's got machined ferrules already inside, Tighten the nut, finger tight. Now, because the machined ferrules are already there, you don't need to pull it up one and a quarter turns. You simply tighten that nut one quarter turn and the job's all done. And the beauty of the plug is you can, again, fully pressurize the system and test it or ship it, anything you need to do. So in review, caps, cap off a piece of tubing, plugs, plug a port. Both can be fully pressurized so that you can pressure test your system to the full pressure rating of your specifications. 